Alabama lawmakers began today with local retailers still suffering to stay afloat. Now they're asking lawmakers and telling them what they need. Sarah Wilson has more. The pandemic continues to spiral out of control, and local retailers are continuing to suffer from it. On February 2nd, Alabama lawmakers met for the first legislative session of the year, and struggling retailers have several things they would like to address. Alabama Retail Association board member Susan Anderson says one of the biggest issues is tax exemptions. An exemption on state income taxes against any federal relief money that any of us um, business owners were able to get during this past year. Anderson says if this gets exempt, Eagle Eye Outfitters, along with several other businesses, will have to pay a huge state income tax. She wants legislators to just remain pro-business. Many retailers shared how abandoned they felt by the state and wanted legislators to keep them in mind. Anderson, who sits on the Alabama Retail Association as a board member, says she wants legislators to keep in mind of the small businesses here in Dothan and think before they make decisions. When they're making these decisions, think through on how that could potentially impact our bottom line. A lot of us are just making it from week to week um, from the revenue we're able to get in because a lot of our sales are de uh, declined so much. Did you know that for every dollar you spend, 72 cents of it goes into a local business? This is why Anderson is encouraging residents to shop local. In Dothan, Sarah Wilson, WDHN News for the Wiregrass.